another video with Trey the DIY Ninja, that's me. Today I'm going to show you how to 5G diamond paint. It's really easy, there's basically no learning curve. All you do when you buy the kit, everything is included. You get all your beads, which are um, either lettered, actually sorry, they're numbered, and the numbers match up with a letter or a symbol on your 5D diamond painting. The picture already comes pre-sticky, so all you do is take off the film or the layer on top. In this case, it's just a piece of like wax paper on top. And they give you this little slotted tray with a wax block, a little stick for the wax, or tweezers. If you do have square beads like I do, I definitely recommend using tweezers instead as the wax circle stick, it's really hard to line up your beads and it's hard to move them if you put them in the wrong place. So tweezers are a little bit of um, extra work because you have to squeeze every time you hold a bead. And if you squeeze too hard, the bead may pop out, which is really annoying. But the overall outcome is a lot better looking than circle beads, but circle beads still look great and they are a lot easier to paint with. So here I am just showing you how I do it. I like to, with square beads, I like to kind of set up like what I like to call a wall so that the other beads next to it will be able to lean on something so I can line them up evenly. Otherwise it just looks a bit messy. So that's my tip for using square beads. But this is a elephant trio that I bought off Amazon. I'll put the link down in the description below if you want to paint this with me. It is really fun and relaxing and rewarding when it's finally done. What you're seeing right now is just one top half slash corner of the entire painting. So this is gonna be my most challenging 5D diamond painting I've done so far. And this encompasses the whole canvas, not just you know, a portion of it, so it'll definitely take me a while to do. So instead of filming probably countless hours and days of me doing it, I thought I'd just give you a little sample for people who are interested in trying it out or just wondering what it is because I only recently discovered what this was too. But yes, if you are a crafter at heart, a cross-stitcher, paint by numbers, a painter, any kind of creative person, and you have the time, you should definitely give this craft a try. So that's about all I have to say about 5G diamond painting. I'll just let you continue watching the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Give this video a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. Click on that bell so you know when I post new videos. And leave a comment. Let me know if you're working on a 5G diamond painting. What you think about it or if you are interested in this or any kind of comment I love interacting with you guys through my comment section it really does make me feel more connected with you guys so that's about it thanks for watching I'll see you guys next time bye